Hi, I'm Louise, and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of Lip Pets. And I'm going to do it with the help of my assistant, Bindi. Well, that's for her after all. Um, if you don't know what Loot Pets is, it's a box <laughs> full of doggy stuff. It's from a company called Loot Crate. They also do other boxes. They do the Loot Crate, they do Loot Gaming and Loot Pets. I have all three here to do because I wasn't here. <laughs> I think these are the Halloween boxes, but I was in America. And it's now the 11th of November and I had to rearrange for the post office to deliver them. So that's me just getting them today. Um, so I'm going to do all three, one after the other. So sorry for the lateness. Um, in addition to these three boxes here, Look Ray also do Look Anime. Uh, they do a bi monthly Firefly and they do special, like, massive Look Crates. I've done a Star Wars one before. Um, that Right now they're doing a Halo. I think that's all. Um, so if you want to know more, um, it works out about £21 a month, but if you want to know more about different subscriptions um, available, go to lootcrate.com and you'll get all the information you need to know. Now, let's go into this. Loot pets. <coughs> right, Cindy, you ready? Let's see what we've got for you. Right, now anyone who's watched my videos before knows that I don't actually look in a box and I'm going to do because I like a surprise, I don't like to see things in advance, which is why I don't open them until I do the hence the unboxing. So the first thing I will go for is a squeezy thing. Ooh, it's a mystery machine, the mystery machine. Scooby dooby doo. That's what is that song? Because we sing Bindi Bindi Boo, where are you? <laughs> so Bindi has a mystery machine, does it squeak? It squeaks! Bindi's favourite thing, she loves a toy that squeaks. Unfortunately my husband doesn't but <laughs> he's just going to need to put up it, right? Get your mystery machine! <laughs> right, we have... I know what that is but we'll hold on a minute. No, there isn't, right. We have a t-shirt. <clears throat> Now sometimes you get a human sized t-shirt as well so you can be matching. Um, this one is ah, Negan Sluggers. That is a Walking Dead t-shirt for the Bindi. <laughs> I like that. Uh, I do like uh, Walking Dead but I haven't seen who died yet. I've got an idea because I saw it on the internet but I haven't actually seen it yet because as I say we were in America. Um, so the in the planner. We haven't had a chance to watch them yet and I'm going to be watching them some point in the next couple of days. But obviously um, people were tweeting about it and stuff and I ended up finding out. I think I've found out anyway but I'm not 100% sure. I'm hoping that at least one of them's wrong. And if you have seen it you can probably guess which one I'm hoping is wrong if it is the right people. <laughs> anyway the next thing we have is treats. It's Spooky snacks, uh, scary good turkey treats for dogs, <laughs> an IP vacuum cleaner. <laughs> you don't know you can see that. <laughs> it's kind of. I'm not good at aiming up. These are. Okay, we were all set for a phantom feast of these ghastly goodies from beyond the grave, and we probably wouldn't have got away with it if it weren't for you meddling pups. These downright terrifying turkey treats are 100% all natural and made in the USA with no grains or gluten. Right, you want to try one of these then, hen? A uh, spooky snack. Bindi want a spooky snack. There you go. You know, want it? You want it? <laughs> sometimes she doesn't... Oh, she seems to be she's eating that one. Uh, sometimes she likes to investigate or hide things before she... She's, she, she loves hiding. If we let her out in the garden, she'd be one of these dogs that obviously let her out in the garden, but if we let her out unattended, she'd be burying bones and stuff, you know, because she hides everything and then goes back to it a couple of hours later. But um, when she eats something straight away, that's usually a massive thumbs up for Bindi. So I'd say that's good. Right, next thing we have is a squishy thing. <gasps> it's gremlins, it's gremlins, it's gremlins. I love gremlins. <laughs> I'm a massive, massive fan of gremlins. So, um, um, 
and Zach Gallagher even follows me on Twitter. <laughs> but I'm, I'm, a, I'm a massive, massive, massive Gremlins fan. And what we have here, if I can open it, I'll need to cut it because it's thingy. What we have here is another pretty cut. <laughs> oh, I'm a big Wayne, but I like Gremlins. I've always liked Gremlins. Uh, I've even got my own gizmo. Up on the shelf somewhere you can't see because I've got the camera aiming this way today rather than that way. This is a pet feeding mat. Don't feed after midnight. Ah uh, well. <laughs> Bindi often eats after midnight because she likes to leave her dry food and go back and get it. Like here and there. And she always ends up eating stuff in her face after midnight. Right, we've got one last thing. Oh, we've also got a sticker. Oh, I forgot about that. Right, I'll show you that in a minute. <laughs> bit of advertising for the Walking Dead there. Send it the back. Oh, I'll just bent my nail. October 23rd. Right. So, this is the horror. <laughs> R.I.P. Tennis Ball. <laughs> Here lies Bone Collection. There you go. Um, don't know if you can see because I'm not good at aiming. I can never do it right. Anyway. This is a card. Now, in every look crate, you always get some kind of card or magazine or something um, which has a list of the products, tells you where to get them and what they are if you don't know. Because, um, especially with like the the look crate, I'm, uh, I'm not as big a geek as my husband, so sometimes I don't even know what a thing is when I open it. I felt like I did it one time with um, a Breaking Bad polo chickeny thing. It was an uh, apron and I haven't watched Breaking Bad, it's something I've never got into watch. I always wanted to watch it but we could never fit it in the planner when it was on and uh, I'm going to watch it at some point, obviously. I keep getting told I need to watch it because it's the most amazing show ever and I really do fancy watching it. Um, but I opened this thing up and there's a chicken I'm going, what is this? I don't know what this is. And then I was I googled it while I was doing the video and I felt like a total, total idiot. So anyway, that's what these cards come in handy for. I couldn't find the card in the other one, I found it afterwards. But anyway, um, you get a list of the products, tells you what they are, where to get them. Um, with the spooky snacks, uh, it says they want to haunt your dog house. Uh, and they're so good, it's a little bit scary. These ghost shaped turkey treats are just what your dog needs to muster up the courage to face those most fearsome foes, loving pets. <laughs> the Negan Sluggers, the pet tea. Negan and the Saviors aren't as nice as their name implies, but it's definitely better to be on their team, the other thing. Right, take on walkers, not walkies, <laughs> in style with his pet shirt and design that complements the look crate human tea. Oh, right. Oh, so we'll get one of them in the look crate then. Mm. <coughs> My husband will be happy. Um, they come in his size, that's why he wears them, not me. Although I did pinch the labyrinth one and I wear it to bed sometimes because <laughs> that was mine. And if there's a very Gremlins one, that's mine as well. Uh, you've got the exclusive Gremlins pet food mat. Let's face it, sometimes your little monster can be messy eating and cleaning up that can be a real horror story. But don't worry, because now you've got a Gremlins pet food mat. Just remember not to feed your mogwai after midnight. <laughs> the coop. Okay, and we have the exclusive, oh, I forgot, the Scooby-Doo Mystery Machine plush toy. Get ready to chew on another zoinks filled adventure with the Mystery Ink gang. Your pup can take a little bit bite out of creepy masked crime just like Scooby-Doo with this perfect, like, groovy plush. And that's by the coop as well. The last thing is this. Now, in every box you get something to commemorate. I think I did. I've put it upside down. There we go. Um, <coughs> this has Michael Myers on it, obviously. Halloween. Um, so it's like this downright chilling charm from 70s horror classic Halloween matches this month's look great pin. Ah, so there you go. I've got a Halloween pin in that as well. Um, thing I'm a bob. So you always get, as I said, you get the wee card or a magazine or whatever to commemorate the box and say what's in it, let you know about it. Um, and then you always get in the pet crate, the look pets, you get a wee collar charm, um, whereas the other ones it's a, a pin or a coin or you know, some kind of badge or whatever. Um, but it's always a, wee, a nice wee kind of commemoration of the box. So, 
I am very happy with that box. I would do a quick recap, but Bindi's, you know, <laughs> I don't know if she's put Scooby Doo. Anyway, so that was this month's Loot Pets. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, share. If you need to contact me, want any information, go to Louisa1980 on Twitter because I'm more likely to be able to reply to you there than I am on YouTube messages because they always bugger up. And, Andy, 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 and what was the other thing I was going to say? Oh, if you need any more information, go to lookcrate.com. Bye!